Hey guys, welcome back to Rustic Borders. Last episode we made some inlining for our armor here, so we can go to the nether and hopefully stay warm enough. This suit is still moving, so creepy. So I think we're gonna do this today. I think we're gonna go over to the nether hub we found. So let's turn on nether portal on. And I'll leave home on for now too. So that is, uh, it's quite a distance away, but we do have the, you know, the, uh, our fancy sea moss. Before we do though, let's get a little bit organized. And I think I'm actually going to buy another Schalke box. Although let me see, does the Schalke box recipe, is this different or something? Uh, no, so you can't easily make these. And if you look at the shop, uh, it's not too expensive. It's like 10, yeah, it's like 10 gil for another Schalke box. So I think I'm actually gonna do this. We can't really make the backpack yet because you know the uh we have to get the flame spider thingy so let's do this get our shaka box noise so we have some extra space for like loot and stuff right so i think this is going to be loot this is going to be kind of like tools and utilities uh we definitely need our super cool drink so i'll leave some on my hot bar uh, i guess the fire slayer could be fine i'm guessing you just right click the fires maybe i'll keep it on me for now we have a cooling pack here as well. Lots of cool stuff, you know, in case we need it. I'll keep an axe on me in case we need it. Uh, wallet can probably go away again. Uh, we don't need this thing. So let's put that in our storage for now. We definitely want the arrows, buckets. Mm, probably not too important. I'm actually going to put this one here back again. Just so we have that water going if we need to. And what else? Food, arrows course our seamos so we can get over there and then once we get there i'll just put the seamos in here so we don't like lose it or something and probably the fire resist potion would be good on us as well so anything else we need i guess that's it right so if we die we shouldn't lose damage on too much stuff other than the armor will will you know bring so let's actually put this in our inventory too so i guess i don't know if we need the um the swimsuit for this because we could just go in there with our CMOS, but I guess I'll take it with me for now, and then before we jump into the portal, I'll swap it out, I suppose. Uh, we do have we do have torches, so that should be good. And we have some extra food. I'll put away the pizza. We have spaghetti too, so as good as what we currently have, so it should be fine. But I think we're good to go. I think we're good to go. Maybe. Let me think about this. Uh, you know, actually, one thing that could be useful is a shield. So in case there's like, you know, blazes or something, I think you can block them with with a regular shield. I mean, there's other shields too. But I think we're just going to take what just a vanilla one, just in case. And also like, I don't know any, if there's any skeletons. There, there has to be like special enemies in that place, right? So it's going to be a bit more uh, dangerous probably. But hopefully everything is good. I don't know if the CMOS can take damage if you... If you die with it in your inventory, so I'll just put it in my box, but uh, I think I'll leave the red here, because the red might just fall into fire or something. I don't think... I forgot if you have the flame upgrade or something. I think there is one, right? Uh, This one here. Mm. Nah, we'll leave it here. We'll leave it here for now. And anyone coming? Nope. Seems all good. So, let's jump into our little CMOS and get back over there. Not too far away, luckily. And we get to, uh, you know, just check out the environment a little bit more. <laughs> I should really like the CMOS. It's so fun to just drive around with this. I think, I don't know if I do it today. We'll see how the nether run goes. Um, but maybe we'll just go, like, travel a ton later just to, like, look around. Maybe, what's this? Oh, there's like lava or something down here. Just a cave system, maybe. Okay. Yeah, maybe we'll just like take the CMOS and like travel in one direction, and see if we can find anything cool and interesting. But here it is. Now, the smart way would probably be. Let me just have a look. There are enemies inside, so there might be a spawner there. There. Oh, game, come on. Stop lagging. There's something. Okay, there's also these like ice dudes in there. I'm just thinking maybe just breaking in from the top might be the easiest and safest, right? And just drown them in there because we can swim, they can't. Um, so maybe I'll do that. Let's see, this is just 
Oh, it's right above. Oh, but actually, will that kill the portal? I'm not sure. Well, let's create like a little bit of water thing so we could escape easily as well. Is this already underwater? Oh. What? What is this? What, what? There's some sort of glass here. Oh, okay. I guess he thought about everything. There must be these like barrier blocks or something that you can't break. Fair enough. <laughs> we go. So we can't e go in from here either. Oh, what a sneaky bully man. What a sneaky bully man. So I guess we have to come in from the from the outside. Now, I don't know. There must be spawners or something, right? Actually, you know what we're going to do before we go up there? I'm going to put on this armor because it's a bit tougher. We don't really need the swimming or the um, air right now since there's no air in here. Oh god, this hurts though. Maybe I should have made a better sword actually, right? A better sword wouldn't have been the worst idea. Where do you guys spawn from? There must be spawners in here somewhere that we can break. Possibly. Are we just gonna die like right here? What the frick? Man, they hurt! This armor is not as great as I thought it would be. Oh yeah, it's not actually that good. Great. <laughs> okay, it's gonna be a bit trickier. See, the thing is... Okay, they can spawn in here. I thought it would be bright enough with these blocks, but I guess not. Alright, let's do... This. We brought it for a good reason. Should work on these guys too, I think. Right. Sure does. Oh, they cool you down when you do that. Interesting. Okay, let's also just put down torches real quick. There's so many of these guys. Oh no, I'm gonna die. Ah, get out of there. <laughs> Damn, these guys hurt. Ah, I should have brought better gear, maybe. I wonder if... Is it really just Electrum that cools you down so much? I wonder if, like, other gear would be better. Although, I don't know if you have access. Well, I think steel... There's a steel chest plate. That would be good. That one is easy. So, I don't know if that... Um, ooh, there's two. Immersive Engineering has a chest steel outfit now? I didn't know that. So let's see what it looks like. That looks really cool, actually. Might be worth doing too. Okay, these guys are spawning like crazy. How about we be smart about this and we're gonna go out of this real quick for a little bit. Let them despawn and then come back. Maybe the light I place will be enough for them to not spawn so much. So let me go try this. Okay, so it seems like they're actually despawned. So we can go quickly back in there. There's still a bit of a dark spot. We need to like light this up real quick. And then it should be... Ugh, come on, why do I get these micro status? Keep going, keep going before they spawn. Someone spawned. You know, just make sure that there's no more dark spots whatsoever. Alright. Where are you at? Why are you up there? That doesn't help me. Okay. So hopefully that prevents them from spawning. I kind of want to see... Are there any spawners hidden? Oh, they still spawn. You know what? There might be in these corners and maybe... Oh, lava. Great. We have not... Wait, I must have picked up blocks. Maybe there are somewhere in these corners, you know? There they are. Haha, <laughs> jerks. Goodbye. Could probably use them for spawners or something later, but for now... I'll just get rid of them. Also put down torches real quick, so that might help a little bit. Alright, and then let's make sure we can take care of them. There's one. And we have, you know, we can always find more of these towers if we need these spawners for these guys. But if we want to use the one... You know, for this here, for just exploring the nether, then... Should probably make this one safe. And there's lava in the corner. Okay, so it's only those two. Ah, <sighs> good. 
<laughs> a little bit safer now. Let's fix this place. I uh, can't quite fix it. Can I do this and this? Okay. Okay. I have a feeling this is not going to go well, is it? So, oh, yeah, already doing that. So let's make sure we put away the good stuff. Well, the CMOS goes in here. Uh, there it is. And then I think I'll just put the suit we have, our diving gear, into here for now. So we don't lose it. And then also any of this loot we just got, right? Just in case. Okay, do we have everything? Let's keep these on our hotbar too. We, what we don't really have is blocks. I should have, maybe I should have brought blocks. Let's just grab these here. So we can block something or pillar up or something if we have to, right? Just in case, so. Okay. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good to go. Drop this one. We have our shaker boxes. We have everything. We have food. Let's go inside and see how horrible the nether is in this pack. Because if we die, we're going to lose durability on our Electrum armor, but that's okay. You know, that's not too bad. I'm mostly worried that the nether is too hot still, but we have so many cooling things, it might be fine. Okay. Not the worst spawn. A little bit open. What I'm just going to do real quick is get a few blocks from here and just cover up the portal slightly so we can be somewhat more protected in case something shoots us or whatever. And I I bet you there is this mod in here where you mine stuff, pigments get angry or something. Which just seemed like something I could imagine them have in here. Okay, I'm just gonna do it like this for now. What I didn't bring is a flint and steel, so... <laughs> that could be bad if they blow up the portal. But let's hope they won't. Let's hope they won't. And also, speaking of portal, we should make sure... We uh, marked this here, right? So we know where to go. Portal. Alright, cool. So, let's have a look around. Spooky nether. It seems like temperature is okay. I'm just gonna grab a couple more blocks that we can work with here. Yeah, it seems like we're totally fine currently temperature-wise. We do have our fire resist if we need to. We run into some crazy blazes. And blazes is actually something we want to find. And these creepy spiders, right? Because they have those flame strings. There's a bunch of soul sand. I don't know if we need any of this. We can always... Well, I guess I should grab a few things. Maybe. Just a couple here and there. There's some sort of red block. I don't know what that is. And also glowstone would be good to get. Heat sand. And tainted soil. Do you have any use for us? Uh, smells into heat glass. Ooh, it's used in something. You can make another furnace. Okay, I don't know if we really need this yet, so I'll just leave it here until we need it. Pigman, you okay? So far, you okay. Alright, it's too quiet. <laughs> it's so quiet in here. Kind of scary. Lots of magma, uh, magma blocks if we need to. Let's see what happens if we try to mine some of this. So far, no one is yelling at us angrily, so that might be a good sign. And it seems like there are just regular ores. Oh yeah, we should try out this thing. Oh, wow, that's really good. I like it. Yeah, there's like lapis here. Okay, I wonder if there's some sort of ores we don't otherwise... Ooh, emeralds we can't otherwise get. Okay, I'm gonna leave... Move this away. I don't think... Oh, we, we're actually heating up a little bit now. Okay. So maybe it's a bit too hot next to the lava. Didn't chop down the whole tree. Gimme, gimme, gimme. So in case we like burn up, I'm gonna to try to walk away from the lava here in a second. And then if it still goes up, we'll just use the potion, I guess. Because there's lots of fire and stuff, so it makes it would make sense that the lava maybe heats you up quite a bit. But so far it's okay. It's not in the it doesn't have the flame icon yet. The flame icon is the one that one <laughs> we don't want, right? So let's run roll away from this a little bit. And see if that uh, we can't really okay, I think I'm gonna to have to drink it. But we don't have too much, so we can't really stay too long, I suppose. A few emeralds here and there. Oh, are you okay? You're okay. Just want to see, like, looks like there's some diamond ore up there, maybe? Of course, ideally... Oh, there's one. There's a fortress. Very nice. There's something green. That's probably just a mushroom. I haven't seen one of these weird spiders yet. Which I'm kind of glad about, but also... 
Oh. <laughs> that guy scared me. Oh, he took my freaking pickaxe. Or did I actually throw it accidentally? Possibly. Okay, do they all have that every time? Okay, they might have a chance to spawn from that. That seems okay. If that's the a nuisance for mining, you know, ores in the nether, I'm okay with that. That's not too bad compared to like Pikmin getting angry at you or something. Okay, I'm gonna grab some glowstone too. Go away. Let's see, I'm heating up quite quickly. How does this one here work? Uh, additional cooling for stated time in the tooltip. Single use. There's no tooltip. It doesn't say for how long. But maybe that will keep us cool for longer, possibly. And if it's if we really like run out of potions and we need some quickly, we can we can actually buy them on the shop real quick. So we should be okay. Should be fine. I don't know if a fire resist potion makes you like stay cool. That would be pretty neat if it does, but I'm not sure if it does. Ooh, what is this? Omega ore. Okay. Don't mind if I do. Omega ore. It makes omega shards, which is used for applied energistics. Ah, and probably some other things. A gem. There's some plates. There's some glasses. There's some stuff. Some custom, custom stuff that we have to use later. Yeah, so this electrum armor with this inlining. Nah, still not great. <laughs> still not great. Oh my god, my pickaxe broke. I didn't even think about that. Shoot. I don't think I brought something... Oh, good job. Some extra ones, did I? Uh, I have a shovel. Okay, what we could do maybe is use this ghost wood. Yeah. Okay. That might work. And can we make diamond pickaxe, perhaps? I could also buy one. Okay, we can make one. We good. We good. No problem. All good there. It's probably a good idea we'd to upgrade them anyway. And then if you find diamonds here, right, it's not a big deal to do that. But yeah, so far it seems pretty calm, which is good. I do sort of want to go to the fortress. We do need to find blaze bots too. Um, I haven't seen a... I haven't seen a blaze spawn naturally yet, which is also a good sign. So maybe... Hmm, how would I get over there? Let's also look around the corner here. Not too much there. It looked like there was an upstairs to this place, though. So it wouldn't, might not be a bad idea to check up there, too. There's more diamonds. Uh, 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 Go away, fire. Ooh, now we're heating up again. Okay, let's try goo pack. What? Oh, I don't know how to use that. Oh, you have to do one at a time. Oh, you toggle it. Chilled for eight minutes. Oh. Oh, yeah, we're cooling down. Oh, that is really good. That's way better. <laughs> so the potions we have is like more like an emergency thing, perhaps. Ow. Jerk. Where you at? Don't kick me into the lava. I don't know where he is. Is he still up there? Oh, he's still up there. <laughs> what a little... Jerk. Get, go, eh, eh, get down there. Hello? There we go. I should probably make a diamond sword soon. Okay, so let's not stand exactly below underneath that thing. Yeah, there's the fortress. We're gonna check this one out too. But I wouldn't mind some diamonds. Good old diamonds. So, so far they only spawn from this, right? Okay. Now we have to go try, probably try to get an enchanting table soon too, so we can get some looting or something, you know? Oh, there's some spiders. Perfect. Hi. You're the ones I need. You're the tiny ones too, which is nice, not the giant ones. Don't like the giant one. Ooh. Ooh. That was a little bit close. A little bit close. That could have, that could have been bad. I guess it's not too bad, like you can't technically lose things in the lava, but of course you can, you know, lose all the durability, which wouldn't be so nice. Okay, that is 13 already. Oh wow, that's probably enough for one of the things we need. Those, oh, those slime dudes. 
Come on. Can he even hit them in midair? I don't even know. I rarely fight them. Okay, so the fortress this way. It looks like we might be able to just get there really easily too. If we go up here, this might actually connect to the top of it. Okay, he's dead. Uh, there's some oh nitro creepers or something, right? Yeah, I forgot about these guys. So they're just gonna blow up whatever, right? No matter what, yeah. Yes, they do. Oh, they don't break this. Interesting. I'm gonna grab as much as we can. We see this stuff somewhere. And again, more diamonds or something would be nice. But yeah, I'm really... Okay, there. Uh, yeah, so if we go up here and make it to there, we can just jump onto this somehow. Let me put down torches so I kind of remember the way. don't think we need lapis at the moment. So spooky. There's a bunch of mushrooms. Do we need mushrooms? Oh, more diamonds, yes. Stay away a little bit for these super annoying silverfish. Okay. Are we getting some stuff? We're getting hot again too, which is not great. But this one alone is not... Oh, maybe it needs to be on a hotbar. Huh. Did it say that? Hold on. Uh, right click and hold to activate. Keep on hotbar. <laughs> Should have read that more. Too nervous to read things for right now. No, it's still heating me up though. I wonder if you can activate two of them at the same time. Oh yeah, now I'm heating up again. Ah, shoot, okay. I guess I'll drink one more of these. At least it will like take a little bit longer now to heat up, I suppose. Any other diamonds exposed? Don't see any. Aha! Come here. It's pro- you know what? I should probably make a diamond sword real quick. I think that would be quite- oh, we don't need a crafting bench. What am I doing? We can do it here. I keep forgetting about this thing. Let's make a diamond sword just so we can uh, kill these a little bit faster, I guess. And let's also make sure we have inventory space. So I'm just gonna put away some things here we don't need. Uh, so we can- oops, uh, pick up more. This one, I'll keep the arrows. And this one, sure. And goodbye stick. Okay, so it's a little bit better. All right, yeah, we could just jump down here. That's awesome. Let me just look at the top two. Uh, looks like there's some diamonds up there. Aha, there you are. Okay, cool. Got him. So that's the spawner down there, which is great. Which actually... I'm going to snack. Oh, wait, but we have the... We still have the merchant spawner in there. Ah, shoot. Okay, I have to come back for this one. I have to drop off the merchant one and then get this one. Might be a bad idea, but I feel like I want to just jump down there. Well, I guess we need to kill them anyway, so... I know that's not going to stop them, but it's going to reduce them a little bit. Let's just make sure there's no one else spawning here. There's a guy. Ah, skeleton is helping me. Nice. <laughs> okay, did we get one? I see one. Yes. We got exactly one. <laughs> Not the best, but it's something. Okay, spawner. Please create more for me. Yeah, they have a way lower light level requirement for spawning. Or I guess higher requirement? No, lower requirement. So yeah, they'll definitely spawn. Come on, do your thing. Okay. Shields are so good. Shields are so good. And I always forget about them. <laughs> Every single time. But yeah, what also kind of like... Uh, we don't need to mark this, we know where it is. Kind of want to check out this fortress in general. So this kind of goes down. Can we... Oh, there's a sec staircase here. So we might be able to get... I don't know, with a skull or something, if we're super lucky. Probably need the, that kind of stuff later, right? Oh, we need blocks. Did I put away all my blocks? I think I did, yes. Yay for shulker boxes! Alright, let's see what's down this way. Ooh, another spawner! Hey! That's awesome. 
That's very good, actually. Hey, oh, I just had a thought. I just had a thought. And also, let's do... Block this off a little bit here so we can... So it's a bit more difficult for them to get through there. But... Can we buy... Ooh, we could buy another moving wand. For 20. You know what? I think I'm going to do this just so I can take the... Spawner with me. I guess it's not that expensive, right? So... Uh, 20. And then we can just bring that with us. Awesome. Now, of course, the downside is if I lose it, then we can't buy it again. Maybe it's not too bad to make. I don't know. Okay, got him. And then, doink. Haha, -ha, now we can just build a farm somewhere for ourselves later. How much? Uh, oh, Oh, wait, no, but you need these things, which... Wait, what? Do they normally require another star or something? That's like the easiest thing in the world. <laughs> okay, never mind. Hey, why do I still have money? Did I take out two? Maybe I took out two. Or maybe I just got one or something. Okay, I'm gonna put you away, so you don't get, like, durability broken or something. And I'll put my wallet away again. Okay. Let's have a look around more. Maybe there's more stuff in here. Maybe some chest. I wonder if the the loot has been changed. The loot tables. Seems like a dead end. <laughs> like an actual dead end. If you jump down there, you're dead. That's how much of a dead end it is. I think if we go down this way, we might reach more. There was this other building over there too. Yeah, if you look at the map. There's more stuff over here. We are heating up though, which is a problem. Oh, because I don't have my goo pack. Is this still active? Oh no, it's gone. Okay. Can't do that with your shield on, it seems. What? Oh no, this one is the old one. This is the one we can activate. Again, if it gets too hot, I'm just gonna buy some more drinks real quick. Which I think I may have to do here in a bit. Uh, it's going down right now. Emeralds, nice. I think there was something we needed emeralds for. I don't remember what though. But we should definitely grab these as well. And now that we have a um, diamond pickaxe, we can make obsidian pretty easy as well. And I probably have to come back here and just grab like a tank of lava or something. But we can make a diamond pick pretty easily, and or uh, make obsidian pretty easily, and then, you know, get an enchanting table and such. So that should be good. Getting a bit more, more items here to work with. Hmm, not too much yet. I wanna, how do I get down into like these lower areas? Maybe this way. You know, where all the goodies are. Where all the chests are. It's all a dead end, though. Hmm. Okay, I think I'm going to look around a little bit for a while, because I think it's we're almost out of time here anyway. But uh, I just want to see if there's any other cool thing we can find before we end here. I think it might actually be this way, but... Yeah. Okay, found some loot. I see a chest. Ooh, it is different. Ender wings teleport to world spawn. Oh, an ender book. That's actually pretty cool. That's going to be good if we have a farm on the top of this uh, surface so we can teleport up easily. A displacement wand. It pushes things. Infinity bimetal gears. Dark boots are good. And this is good too. It's actually some good stuff. Nice. So good to know that there is customized loot in these. Which makes me very happy. That means we can actually find some good stuff. And not just, here's a potato or something. I don't, I don't even remember what the vanilla blue table spawn in. Oh, hi. Oh, shit, I don't have my blocks. I was playing regrows, so now I'm like spam clicking again to attack. Not good. Like, bad habit. Grab the chorus fruit. Hardy snack. Let's see, face through the wall for a few seconds, okay? Unlock blocked villager traits. That's kind of cool. And then more of these things, too. Do we have any more room in our chest, though? Or are we already full? Eh, a little bit. Little bit, I guess. Eh, that's it, I guess. Yeah. We need a backpack. But now that we have the flame string, we can actually make one. That's one of the things the backpack required, or the satchel, or whatever. And that's death. Okay, I guess um, it doesn't look like there's too much more. There might be another part of this fortress over there. And maybe this way, if I look at the minimap. Yeah, there's some pillars there, but 
Might be, might be a bit tricky to get to. Let me just clean out these guys. And dead. At least we get some more rods here, which is good. How many do we have by now? Only four, unless I put some away. Maybe I put some away. Um, ah, not in time. Yeah, it seems like maybe there's more of this, but I think for now, we'll leave this alone. There's a Wither Skeleton up there too. And now I'm kind of curious if we can just teleport back with the Hearthstone. So let's try this. It is charging. So maybe that will work. I'm not sure if it teleports us to the nether beginning. No, it seems like it teleports us back to the overworld too. Nice! Yeah, to our bed. That's awesome. Very cool. Alright, so that was a somewhat successful trip. We got some goodies out of there. We got the things I wanted, which is the flame string. So we can actually make stuff with that. Let me see what else there is. Is it just a satchel? It's just a satchel and then later there's some some stuff as well, which is cool. Um, but yeah, that was one of the one of the quests here somewhere to make this satchel. There we go. Go down here and get a bit more storage. But this is this is gonna be nice having a satchel, you know. And we have the the blaze rod now, which we needed a couple of times. We can make potions. Uh, we can make a uh, enchanting table next. So good stuff, good stuff. I think we are gonna have to end here though for today. I'm just gonna dump everything I found into here. Those boots are nice too, especially once we get power production. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys soon. Bye-bye.